Hey guys, and welcome to the Family Fudge. In today's video, I'm sharing some of the juiciest secrets about bunches of lunches. And I'm also going to answer some of the most frequently asked questions that I get from you guys. I'm gonna split this up into two videos, so today's video is part one. I'm gonna kick things off with question number one, and that is how bunches of lunches got started in the first place. And to answer that question, I have to take you back to the very beginning, because back at the beginning, I was sharing lots of recipes for dinner, freezer meals, kid-friendly recipes, and things like that. So I was already sharing lots of food on the channel. So when I started getting lots of requests from you guys to share lunches, I said, definitely, that sounds really fun. So Bunches of Lunches was inspired by you guys. Next up, I have a juicy secret to share. Now, many of you already know Luna Lunchbox. She is our official lunch mascot. <laughs> but did you know that she actually has a twin brother named Lenny? Hey guys, I'm Lenny. That's right. There's Luna and Lenny. So keep looking for Lenny. He's gonna start appearing in our lunch videos very soon. Moving right along to juicy secret number three. Did you guys know that Bunches of Lunches has an official jingle, like a little song? We had it made for the series, but we never ever used it because I thought it sounded a little babyish. but I'm gonna let you guys hear it anyway. So this is an exclusive sneak peek. So yeah, there's the song that we never used. This next secret is all about how I organize the lunches. I've actually created lots of different worksheets to help keep myself organized so I know what lunch I'm making, what day I'm making it, and all the different themes and elements going into the lunch. Now sometimes I have the entire week's worth of lunches completely planned out. I know what's gonna be in the lunch, and I even know what napkins I'm going to use. Other times I get really busy and life gets in the way, and I end up just throwing into the lunchbox whatever I have in the fridge. I mean, it's not organized at all. Next up, I have another super juicy secret. I've never shared this before, but we do get asked quite often about merchandise. And here's the answer, you guys. Yes, I'm putting together my own lunchbox kit. In this kit, I'm hoping to have sandwich cutters and vegetable cutters, actual bento boxes, silicone liners, everything that you might need to get started making fun lunches. I'm also working on some fun t-shirts and aprons. I wanna have adult aprons and kid aprons that can match so you can get in the kitchen together. They'll be super cute. I'm also working on some eBooks and a really fun game that I'm super excited about that one. So stay tuned for those. Next up, I have a frequently asked question, and that is, how many lunches have I actually made? And that is pretty hard to figure out. I've been doing the Bunches of Lunches series for over a year, even on holidays. Each episode has five lunches, and then in each episode, I made three of each of the lunches, plus there were toddler lunches, and letter lunches, and now subscriber lunches. I'm gonna estimate that I've made 1,350 lunches on camera. That's a lot of lunches. Now, to kinda go along with that question, the next one is, out of all the lunch episodes, which one is my most favorite? My most favorite episode of Bunches of Lunches ever was the one that we did from Disney World. So this is a Bunches of Lunches traveling type video where we actually show you what we're having and what we're doing in the video. So it's a little bit of a different style, but I really love to travel and experience new foods in different places. And of course I love Disney, so yeah, that's definitely my most favorite episode. I will link it down below if you haven't seen it, but yeah, it's definitely my favorite. Okay guys, that's all the time we have for today. Don't forget to come back next Friday for part two, where I share more juicy secrets and answer your questions. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye.